Draft, WoodwardSports.com, chat poll. Are you taking a quarterback in the first round? Very simple question. 83% of you say no. So see, Spenny, it's it's more than you think. Yeah. It's more than you think. Uh, CJ Schneider, if Anthony Richardson, and here's, I'm looking for discourse like this. If Anthony Richardson is there at 18, his cap hit is minimal, and you're able to develop him is the logic. Goff going to want an extension. We can look at the Eagles as a reason to take the rookie deal quarterback. And, guys, look, you, you know where I live with that. Here's the thing for me. A, Goff is 28. And you, you can't like you can't go back to – you have data, right? Like, this was a Pro Bowl caliber season. That's factual, right? Factual. 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 All right. Oh, I got four of them. So, yeah, okay. This was a Pro Bowl caliber season. Even spend more racks. Had to give Goff his flowers. Yes. And I do enjoy a good rookie contract, as you know. No, Maybe no one enjoys it more than me. If, if the rookie contract was bourbon, what kind of bourbon would it be? Oh, I, I think the rookie contract would be, it would be that Eagle Rare. Okay, there where it is. It's, where it's like 33 bucks a bottle, but you can't get it anywhere because everybody loves it so much. Except in New York. Except in New York. And if you got people. Yes. So there you go, the Eagle Rare. So that's how Neil, he cherishes as much as we yeah. know how much Neil cherishes his bourbon. Right. But Jared Goff is 28 years old. It's not like, and, and look, I'll get into it. The thing with me, and I've held true with this since the day the Lions got him, I was a little miffed at the extension when they traded for him. However, after I saw Holmes operate, I saw what he was doing. Stretch it out, lower the cap number. I, I saw what he was doing. He had to cleanse the soul of the financials of this team. And DMAC, again, at $30 million bucks, he outperformed $30 million. Is that fair? Yeah. So then it's a positive investment. I would say. Baseline. He produced more than what he was worth. My question when you bring that up is, it, is are they going to be able to do the same? Will they be looking to do the same thing again with Goff at a lower number, stretch out the – or or is that something that you're will, we're working away from? Because I think at 28, people don't realize that's sort of – so he's in – right now, this year, next year, the year after, that's the – you know the heart of right. his of his career. So I mean that it actually speaks better for him that he can go back to back with with the same OC with the age that he is. There's age ain't a thing. It's Dmac. Right? When you were a 28 year old player, were you better than when you were a 24 year old player? Yes, yes. I was in the is, middle is of winning that, cups. Is, is that is right. that pretty? I didn't much, win a cup till I was 25. Right. That's pretty much how it works, right? It's pretty much universal, you would say, right? Gotta if learn, you're healthy. Got to learn how to win. Yeah, if you're I mean, healthy. It depends on what situation you go to, but yeah. Coming, As a general Coming role. into your own. Can we agree that we've seen, like, Jared Goff came into his own this year? Now, if he can ex extend it and repeat it and stuff like this, and we were talking yesterday about how many interceptions you s expect him to throw, and we all agreed that it will probably be up, Right, like this year, we don't ex hold him to a, the fire to repeat this year. It's not the guy, but he's got to be around it, don't you think? Yeah, he's got to be in the ballpark. In the ballpark, because everything is playing well towards him. Now you'll have his people age, like the you'll coaches. have people like the easies of the world that say, "Well, he threw 13 interceptions this year." You know, as one gets tipped at the line or whatever. You know, yeah, but they're going to throw more shots to James. I would hope that. You know, there's more balls, deep balls downfield to some of your to your speedy guy. That sometimes, you know, there might be interceptions because of that. Yeah, you might yeah. lose a few. Three one three sports guru says, Neil, you kind of look like Goff. I don't see that. Ah, uh, at the bank. <laughs> at the bank. That's what he's saying in the bank line. Yeah, yeah. When, it's it, just, when it comes to number of furnaces. Yeah. When it comes to number of furnaces, um, I I just don't. I, I just don't get it where why why is Goff like why is why why this clamoring to replace him and get him out of town? But again, Spemo help me understand it. People talk like he's thirty six years old. Yeah, I mean Can can is Goff. Hey, Spenny, can you open your mind to the fact that maybe he's developed and maybe he's getting better and maybe he could be really good? Or no? No. It, no. Okay. Yeah, okay. Here's the question: What's no, more really of the good. truth, LA Goff or Detroit Goff? 
But we've, we've seen this from LA golf before. Yeah, but we've seen this from golf when he has an elite play caller, an elite offense designed around him. He can do this for sure. But it's not. Still, it's not something that will take you over the top. What do you mean it won't take you over the top? You don't need him to take you over the top. That's why you put everything around him, sort of. I, it's, I mean, you don't think he's got what it takes to, to, to cash one Bowl? in? No. I guess he still hates golf. <laughs> Did you see enough to, to, to know what the things around? Because to me, it's more who's going to be there, and your quarterback doesn't hamstring. Well, see, D Mac, your, here's, and here's my qualifier. Team. Here's a qualifier. And you know where this is. And I think that I have a structural, philosophical difference than Spenny does or Easy does or, or any of the other, you know, golf. I don't want to call them haters because Spenny, Spenny's capable. Criticizers? You know? Criti- yeah, that's fair. Truthers. True. No, 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 not truthers. <laughs> I don't like that term. <laughs> but anyway, here's the thing for me. Jared Goff, at a discount to the quarterback market, I will roll with. At thirty million, when other quarterbacks are making forty, in a, in a world where Kyler Murray's making if, forty-seven million, yeah. So for the next two years, because he's going to want to raise if he continues to play. Like but this. what if he does? What if? What if it's like that? That's what my question was about extending it out. Like, because the question you asked at the beginning, this year, did Jared Goff from what he's getting paid, is there value to it? If you can always answer that question, yes. I heard saw somebody in the chat to say Goff should do what Brady did, right, and help out the other team. Who says that? He won't like the the deferred. He's already showed that he'll defer to help the team out. I think this is a question that is going to be coming up not this year, but more so next year and stuff right. like this as a, as the team goes. Because here, Neil, you said it. Because he's only twenty eight, so it's so it's still the big question to be answered. You expect him, Spenny, to go out there for the top dollar, but maybe not. Mm-hmm. Maybe not. There's still like here's the one thing is that I would think. Because of Goff's history, and he showed that he will play ball with the organization, maybe that conversation to him is different than other quarterbacks and also what they're building here. I'm hoping, but there, that's, I think he's your quarterback for longer. Uh, and Brandon Katt says, uh, Goff is only $10 million less than other quarterbacks. Okay, Brandon, that's one way to put it. Or he's 25% less and achieving at a level that's Pro Bowl caliber. You see, we can we can both play games with numbers, my friend. You know what I'm saying? I think mine sounds a little more impressive, but they're both factually true. And again, we're in a we're in a world where Kyler Murray makes 47 million dollars. They willingly signed him to that, and it doesn't matter what you think. He's a bum or whatever. That's what he signed. So you know what? When Lamar Jackson comes up, he says, "I'm getting more than that clown is." That's Josh it. Allen gets a 30 that, million dollar raise next year. Yeah, their window is closed. They're, they're, it, it's closing, no yeah. doubt. It's closing, and that's where with the Lions, that that's a, all the more reason why you can't do this quarterback stuff. These windows slam shut, man. Mm-hmm. They slam shut. One day you wake up and the window's closed, and for the Lions, the wi- the window started to open in the second half of this year. Next year, it's if you expect a division championship, and th- and that will lead into my next question, my next poll as a WilbertSports.com chat poll. Are you taking a quarterback in the first round? Eighty-three percent of you say no, and that that was fairly, that was fairly uh, consistent. Spenny, the, the one going into the next 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 segment. Do you expect the Lions to win the division this year? Do you expect? You see me walking everybody down the park to the park right now, don't you? You yeah. see where I'm going with I this? I knew it. I knew. It. <laughs> Listen, what do you think I grabbed my coat for? Yeah, yeah. I knew we'd be outside for a minute. I know you guys are riding the bike, and Dad's running behind you right now, holding the you know holding the seat. Sure, your helmet's done on. But now, at the next segment, I'm going to let you go, and you're going to pedal yourself. That's fair. And you're either going to ride the bike. Or you're going to fall on the concrete, and then I'll have to get the stupid peroxide out and clean up all the cuts and all that kind of stuff. But, yes, that, that's the question we're going with. Do you, real, t- real talk, bottom line, do you expect the Lions to win the division next year? That's what I got to know, and that's what we're going to find out, and that's what we're going to discuss when we come back. 